which is real-time action with strategic command-based combat. For starters, each press of the square button is a swing of Cloud's Buster Sword. Cloud attacks, dodges, and blocks all in real time. His standard attacks do some damage, but they barely scratch the surface of Cloud's true potential. Succeeding on the battlefield requires much more than just hacking and slashing. Cloud needs to be tactical. He needs ATB. Two ATB bars are displayed in the lower right. These fill up slowly over time, but fill much faster as Cloud lands standard attacks. Once an ATB bar is full, you can enter tactical mode where time slows to a crawl and you have the opportunity to choose actions from the com command menu. Katasi-san, I've had the pleasure of seeing quite a bit of the game, but tactical mode never gets old for me. I could just sit here all day long and watch this beautiful slow motion action. I think the audience would like to see more. Isn't that right, everyone? <laughs> Fair enough. Good point, good point. <laughs> Yeah. Well, once in tactical mode, you can choose to perform various abilities, such as Cloud's Braver attack. Using an item in battle will deplete an ATB charge, and if Cloud has the right materia equipped and enough MP, he can use ATB charges to cast spells. Of course, this being a remake, we're sure to see some familiar faces. With the use of his iconic gun arm, Barrett is able to target enemies at a distance. Barrett's standard attacks generate ATB charges similar to Cloud, but his abilities are entirely different. Switching between characters in combat is done with a single button press, which makes rotating through party members a snap. Speaking of other party members, Katasi-san, when are we going to see Tifa in action? Oh. 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 Maybe, maybe soon. Soon. All right. Characters will continue to fight even when you're not controlling them directly, but it's up to you to choose how and when ATB charges are used. You can maximize your effectiveness by switching between characters or issuing commands to characters with full ATB bars. Every enemy has a focus gauge that fills up as you do damage. When the gauge is full, the enemy becomes staggered and you'll deal bonus damage. Tactical mode evokes the command selections from the original Final Fantasy VII and allows players to enjoy battle while taking the time to think strategically. For players who prefer fast-paced action, abilities and spells can be bound to shortcuts for immediate execution. Shortcuts make combat extremely dynamic, but the choice of using them is entirely up to you. Right, Katase-san? That's right. The game has been made so that you can choose how to play. I hope players get excited about this. Well, that's a brief introduction to combat in Final Fantasy VII Remake, and we look forward to showing you a whole lot more in the coming months. For now, let's see how Cloud and Barrett do against a more formidable foe. Focus on 
that corner. Oh, now he remembers. Don't keep me waiting in suspense next time. <laughs> Take him down. This is now. You're not. Damn thing showed you how it's done. Come on, we've got to move. Please welcome.